Hi everyone, in this video we'll talk about how you can set up the Wati plugin on your Zoho CRM. It's a very simple step. You have to click on uh, settings icon on your Zoho CRM account. Go to your marketplace, click on all. Search for Wati in the list of apps. You'll be able to find the Wati extension. Click on install. You can agree to the terms and then click on install. Wait for it to be installed. Agree to the terms again and then continue to install. You can decide which users you want to install for. Takes a few seconds. Okay, it has been installed now. Once it has been installed, you'll be redirected to the extension settings page. You can decide if you are already an existing what user, you select this. If you're new to what you click on this and then sign up. I'm selecting existing what user and then clicking on next. Over here, you have to add the API endpoint URL. It's very easy. On your what account, you go to API docs. This is the endpoint URL. You copy this, put that here. You copy the access token, put that here. You can decide what is the default country code that you use for your account. In this case, we're not using any default country code. And you can also decide which is the field on Zoho that you use to uh, map your phone number, the WhatsApp phone number. So you can either decide to use a phone number field or a mobile number field. This is the setting that allows you to decide a rule where Anytime someone, any contact is created on what you want that to be that contact to be created automatically on Zoho, whether you want it to be created as a lead or a contact, you can decide it from here. You're setting it as a contact here and then we would save the settings. So this is how you set up uh, the what plugin on Zoho CRM. Thank you.